How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, play some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. Today's video is going to be dedicated to Royal Warrior Thor. The first skin that we've actually unlocked in the Battle Pass, if you're not counting, of course, the Jormungandr Mako. Uh, this one you get just automatically just by getting the premium Battle Pass, so I'm not really counting that. This one we actually had to earn, so... I consider it the first skin that we got. What's the next skin while we're here? Let's see. Next skin isn't for a while. That's going to be Master Blacksmith Ulgrim. I cannot wait to get this Cosmic Radiance UI theme. But for now, we're going to dedicate this video to Royal Warrior Thor. Now, if you caught my live stream yesterday, then you did see me play Royal Warrior Thor one game. I did play one game with Royal Warrior Thor because somebody requested that I play Thor, I think. But... Other than that, I have not played this skin, and this entire video will be dedicated to this skin because it's not every day that I unlock a new skin from a battle pass. And considering there's only a few skins in this battle pass, I want to make a dedicated video to each one every time I unlock them, just like I did for past battle passes in the past. So anyways, let's take a look at all the colors for this one. This one, The community colors actually is kind of cool. I like the streak in his hair, um, but let's take a look at the rest of them. Soulfire looking really good. Charge to G. Gala looks pretty cool. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I think that, uh... Ooh, black. I think to start it out, I'm probably gonna go with... Classic. And then we'll pick a few different colors after that. Ooh, actually, let's do the default weapons as well. At least for the first game. Wait, that's not classic. There we go. Let's do all default, all classic, at least for the first game. And then we can go ahead and change it up after that. If you guys like the Battle Pass and Brawlhalla content, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps me out. All right, we're going against Fault the Alt. Fault? Fault the Alt. That's, <laughs> that's kind of hard to say. All right, here we go. It's going to be tough going against a Fate. Fate is a really good legend, obviously. But so is Thor. Um, I'm not the best with hammer, but I'm all right. Ooh. All right. Ride the lightning, fate. Or not. Oh, no! I didn't have a recovery. <laughs> oh, man. That's gonna be a good fight. Let's see how I do with the hammer. Got her. There we go. All it takes is one recovery, and we are back in it. God of Thunder. Let's go. I gotta do better than that. Whoa, we're getting a little bit of lag. Oh my gosh, I'm teleporting again. Oh yeah. Boom. Pick her up and send her flying with that scoop de doop. Oh, nice throw. I do that too, where I throw it up because people always jump.
<laughs> that lightning baby, we got him. GG dude, GG. That was a good one. G a G. Alright, for the second game, let's do something different. Um, I think I'm gonna go with Soul Fire, because it looks kind of spooky on Thor, doesn't it? And let's give him the Yokai Smash Hammer. And let's do the Remnant of Fate Orb. Should I change up the sidekick? Sure, why not? Let's go Wendigo. And for the stance, I feel like speed. Oh, that takes away from dexterity. Mm. Actually, let's do dexterity. Let's do dexterity. I usually like to boost whatever stat is the weakest. Especially if it has a lot of, if I already have a lot of defense by default. I don't need more than like five defense. So we'll just go ahead and bop that defense down. Um, I already had seven, so I still have six defense, but we brought our dexterity up, so let's see how we do. Going against Deathen. Ooh, he's got the forest fire on the Azoth. That looks really cool. Ooh, man, he hasn't even touched us yet. Woo, zero to death with Thor, let's go. All right, let's try the hammer out. Let me help you up there, Azoth. Oh my goodness, we broke his recovery. And we are looking at a three stock. Okay. Oh my goodness, how did I get sent that way? I don't know. Ooh, he got me there. Hard to survive against a bow when you're in red health, man. Bow is just too good. We are using all of our moves here to the best possible outcome. GG! Oh my goodness. Normally I struggle against Azoth because Azoth has a lot of defense and he's just a really good legend, but we did really good there. Ooh, I'm almost done with my orb light attack damage. All right, I need ground pound KOs, spear KOs, exhausted recovery KOs. I need all that stuff. Um, in fact, I also need to hit multiple opponents with a single gadget. I still have yet to do that, but that's all right. Um, let's see, I think I'm gonna go charge doji this time. And for the hammer, let's go sucker punch that big old heart on a stick. And let's do another animated orb because they look cool. Wow, all right, the heart hammer doesn't look good with those colors, but check this out. Gala colors, it's a black heart. <laughs> it's like black licorice flavored or something. I don't even know. All right, here we go. Black heart on a stick going against Mookie, the orange fisted werewolf. Is Mordex a werewolf or is he just like a dog or a wolf, I should say? Just a wolf or a werewolf? I think werewolf because he's walking on hind legs, right? That makes him that makes him a werewolf. All right, here we go. Nice, nice gauntlet gimp. That's all it takes is one nair breaking the recovery and boom. All right, 
He definitely knows what he's going for. How did I not hit with that hammer throw? Woo, there's a ground pound KO. I need those. All right, we are a little bit behind, but not too bad. Go, Mordex. Oh, off the bottom of the stage. Woo. Oh, my goodness, what a perfectly placed gravity cancel side sig. Oh, don't care yourself, Mookie. Scoop him up, send him flying, and just like that, we are even on final stocks, baby. Very close right there. Boom! There it is. GG, dude. GG. That was a good fight. We were, like, losing that entire match. But we kept on fighting, and we got the win at the very end. GG, though, Mookie. GG. Always fun. Hey, Tear up in the battle pass as well. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, that's a cool-looking bow. Can't wait to use that. And another 15% on the battle pass XP. I will take it. And we got one ground pound. I need 48 more ground pounds, my goodness. All right, we're gonna do one more game with this skin. Of course, we're gonna end it with black on the Royal Warrior Thor. And for the hammer, I'm thinking bacon on a stick or making bacon pancakes hammer. And for the orb, ooh, should I do the essence of Niflheim? The battle pass orb. Oh man, that bacon hammer, <laughs> that looks so funny. Oh man. All right, here we go, guys. Last match versus an Ember. Ooh, I feel like this is a good matchup for us. Uh, just because I think Thor would do good versus an Ember. Unless the Ember is very calculated. Doesn't miss. Very accurate. If the Ember is very accurate with the... Uh... Wait, no! No! Am I lagging or did they just kill themselves? Sub I've been teleporting a little bit this morning. Oh, man. All right, well... I'll take a homie stock. I don't know what happened there, but I don't like doing that just because now we're going to have a shorter match. Don't walk into my hammer, sick. Oh, that turn around recovery. Get some every time. Ow. And apparently the bomb gets me every time. No, she killed herself. All right, that game doesn't count. That was terrible. That was a terrible game. Let's try again. Let's try again. I actually want a full game here. All right, here we go. A diamond mirage using the gala colors. She's using the scythe from that one Jiro skin. All right, here we go. Best of J2021.
Boom! I love that side six so much. And the down six. Woo! There's another ground pound KO. I get them slowly, but I am getting them. It's just taking me a while. Jump recovery got me. The cool thing about Thor and Orb is that you can pretty much survive forever just by doing like ground pounds, uh, neutral sigs, all that stuff. It's very hard to approach me because of all the different ways that Orb makes my person move around. Oh, the double, okay. Ooh, okay. Nice, nice, nice. What? She didn't even hit me, she hit next to me and it still sent me flying down. The sheer force of the blast. Ooh, she's really going into hardcore mode now. Ooh, my goodness, Mirage. Hammer did not hit her. Beautiful throw. Still didn't hit her. Well, well, GG did GG. <laughs> still got my ground pound, so I'm still happy. And a tear up. Let's go. Oh, Forest Fire, Yumiko. Nice. I mean, I did want this, but I still don't have a Blaster Legend with Forest Fire. Wait. <sighs> I still don't have a Blaster with Forest Fire. <laughs> <laughs> GG though, dude. GG. Um, I'm pretty sure. Let me check. Let me check. Oh, I have Cassidy. Okay. I, I didn't realize I got Cassidy. All right. So Cassidy is my only legend with blasters with forest fire. All right. Cool. So anyways, that was uh, Royal Warrior Thor. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did. It looks like it's going to be a little while before we get our next skin, which is the Master Blacksmith Olgrim. So we're going to be doing other videos in the meantime. Uh, continuing our Rocket League Road to Grand Champ, and also our Brahalla Road to Diamond Unarmed. Or I'm sorry, not Unarmed, Random. We're doing Random to Diamond. Uh, so, very fun, very good times coming up, and as always, guys, I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.